So Belinda, would you like to tell this lovely audience then what your phobia is? Um, rats. Okay, rats, beautiful. Actually, what I want you to do first is you've been to a cinema, yeah? So I want you to imagine in your mind that you're at the cinema. Right, you've taken a seat in maybe in the front section but maybe right at the back, okay? And you're in front of the big white screen, all right? On that big white screen, there's gonna be a movie of you. What I want you to do then is float out of your seat where you are mm -hmm. and back into the projection booth. Mm -hmm. So in that projection booth, you're watching yourself sitting in the chair, watching yourself on the movie screen. Yeah? Is it okay with your unconscious mind for you to clear this phobia today and for you to be aware of it consciously? Beautiful. So what I'd like you to do is actually go back to the first event of when you developed this phobia, all right? And what I want you to do, there's every event has a beginning and an end. Mm -hmm. So what I want you to do is run a movie on that screen, cinema screen. So you're in the projection booth, watching yourself, sitting in the cinema, watching yourself on the screen, all right? So what I want you to do is, you're from the projection booth, you're gonna run that movie mm -hmm. of when your ph phobia first began, yeah? So I want you to run that movie from the beginning in black and white until the end. When it gets to the end, I want you to freeze frame it and white it out, okay? And can you do that now? Run the movie black and white from the beginning to the end. When it gets to the end, freeze frame it and white it out. Great. What I want you to do now is from that seat I want you to go into your, associate into your body at the end of that movie, yeah? Done, beautiful. What I want you to do then is run it backwards in color right to the beginning. Now come back and sit in your seat. So you're in the projection booth, watching yourself, sitting in the seat, watching yep. yourself on the screen. Yep. I want you to run the movie again from the beginning to the end in black and white. Yep. When it gets to the end, freeze frame it, white it out. Mm -hmm. I want you to float into your body at the end and I want you to run it backwards in colour to the beginning. <laughs> Good. Now I want you to come back in your seat. I want you to run it from the beginning to the end in black and white. When it gets to the end, freeze frame it and white it out. Mm -hmm. Good. Now I want you to run it backwards in colour. Yep. I want you to associate into you, run it backwards in colour. Good. Mm -hmm. She knows what to do now. Mm -hmm. So I want you to do a few more times. Beginning to end, black and white. Freeze frame. Associate. Run backwards in colour. Mm -hmm. Good. Beginning, black and white. Freeze frame. Associate. Backwards in colour. Mm -hmm. And that Benny Hill music still playing every time you go backwards. Beautiful. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. And they're all running away from me. It's so lovely. Yeah. All right. So the question is now, you run that for as long as it takes to do it. Yeah, when I first saw it, it was a bit, yeah. it was a bit scary, but it, then it just, then yeah. it looked weird. Yeah, then yeah. It just went a bit weird and then it just went, then it was okay. Yep. How do you feel about it now? Yeah, good. I've got a, a warm, I like to feel warm. Yep, yep, yep. So yep. where it used to be a terrified yep. feeling, now it just, it's not, it doesn't feel comfortable warm, it just feels just really warm. All right, so... so a, if no, no, it's not a discomfort, it's oh. not an uncomfortable warm, it's yep. just a warm. Yep, yep, all right. So I'm now, if I was, <laughs> oh, you're not worse, used to. I'm not used to that. Yep, yep. yep. So if I was to mention rats to you now, what happens? So a moment ago, you could feel something different, yeah? So yeah, that feeling's right. changed? Yeah, it was here. Mm -hmm. It was very much here. Yeah. Mm. How is it different now? Um, I don't see, I don't see it here. Mm -hmm. So I can say rats, I can say, Rats! Yeah, you can say rats. <laughs> yes, you can say rats. Yes. I can say rats, rats, rats. Yeah, you can say rats. Can you say rats? I can say rats. You can, yes, say, I rats. can say rats. Rats, 
Yeah. My children will be amazed. I can say rats. Yes. They can say rats. Yep, I can say rats. Yeah. yeah. Benny Hill's unreal, isn't he? He's a weirdo, but... He yeah, is, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was going to say, now I see a weirdo running around instead of rats, that's great. But, <laughs> okay. Yeah, it feels, it feels good. It feels so... Great. So the test is then, so imagine that there was a rat on the table over there where Karen's sitting. What happens? I feel sorry for Karen, but it's okay. <laughs> Alright. So there's a rat on Pam's folder. I don't want it to come much closer because I think they're quite busy. So mm -hmm. I don't want it to come much closer, mm -hmm. but I think it's okay. Yep. Alright. That's all it's because the thing is, they don't have to love the thing that they didn't like. They don't have to love it at all. And bear in mind, with some phobias, you have to make sure you do the right thing. If I worked with her a little bit more, she'd hold it no trouble at all. All right? It wouldn't be a problem. But the whole thing, it's not necessary. The thing is that she needs to be able to be comfortable with the word, to be able to say the word, to be able to be, hey, look, that's pretty close sitting there. Which one of you would allow a rat to get much closer? You know? Well, too close to you, yeah, but it's gone now. It's gone now. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's absolutely normal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like anything that frightens you in that regard. Yeah, yeah. The healthy, yeah, that's right, yeah. look, that is close enough for me. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I don't want them any closer than that. Yeah. And I don't want to hold it. Oh, no, I used to just literally vomit. If I walked into a pet shop and I felt that there were rats in there, I would vomit and have to leave. Or if we had a rat in our yard anywhere, or we had pods in the chair, I would be in fetal position in the pod chair. Okay, good. So safe. I want to ask you about that now. So say, for example, you saw a rat now in your yard as you were walking around doing whatever it is that you do in your yard. Mm -hmm. Or actually, I didn't scream anyway, I just like collapsed. All right, so. I would just so like faint. Yep. So just imagine now that you're actually at home where maybe once before you would have seen a rat mm -hmm. and did exactly what you just said. What happens now when you think about that situation with how you would respond now? Um, I think I'd be a bit pissed off that there was a rat in my yard. Yep. Would you collapse? No, I think I'd just be pissed off that yeah. there was a rat in my yard. Good. Yeah. That's what you need to, you need to, you know. Oh, and I'm testing. And my dogs aren't doing the job they're supposed to be doing. They're supposed to be doing. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you very much. Thank you. And that's the fast phobia model.